Hello, this video is going to show you how to trim back a Cat5 wire to prepare you for termination through an RJ45 connector or to a Keystone connector. The tools you'll need is this Cat5 stripper and a pair of electrician scissors or crimp scissors sometimes called. First thing you do is you take the Cat5 strippers and you put it on the wire about two inches down and you want to give it three full twists or more if you want then you can actually pull a little piece of the external jacket off the wire. You'll notice you have a little string here. Now what the string is for is so you can actually pull it additionally a couple inches down. The reason why you want to do that is because you might have scored the wire here accidentally when you trimmed it back. So this way the actual wire you're going to be using doesn't have any abrasions on it or cuts or, or anything that could possibly uh, compromise your final connection when you do it. You notice you have four pairs of wires here. Orange and white, green and white, blue and white, and brown and white. But you still need to separate these wires a little bit. I'm going to cut a little excess of string off. And you can use a little piece of jacket that you cut off initially and you put it on one of the two wires and as you move it down you can separate these very easily first pair is your brown and brown and white then you've got the blue and blue and white pair and I'll give you a close up on how I'm doing this you just separate the wires a little bit put the little piece of jacket on, move it down and see, makes it really easy so you've got your four pairs of wires now you are fully ready and prepared for either your RJ45 or Keystone Jack connection to be made. 